All right, Snapping Beans by Lisa Parker. I snapped beans into the silver bowl that sat on the splintering slats of the porch swing between my grandma and me. I was home for the weekend, from school, from the north. Grandma hummed, what a friend we have in Jesus, as the sun rose, pushing its pink spikes through the slant of corn stalks, through the fly-eyed mesh of the screen. I tried to um, help them see, in a very subtle way, how these pieces of literature connect to them. Um, and how they might illuminate something about their own life or about the situations going on. Um, and that even something written in the 17th century can be applicable to our own lives today and help us understand something about ourselves. I never wanted to be a teacher. I came from like these many generations of teachers. And so I was not going to be a teacher, obviously. To school, I got a, a degree in English Lit. Okay, I think I'll teach for just a year or two and then I'll probably go back to grad school. And then within my first week of teaching, I felt so connected to my students and cared for them so much. And I just knew it was something that I was good at. I had a talent that I didn't know that I had. So I teach AP Literature and Composition for seniors and English One Standard for freshmen. You know, somebody was like, oh, that's so many preps, like that's such different work and it's really not. I'm teaching the same skills in different ways and oftentimes what I find is that I'll use the same assignments. Being a good teacher to my standard students, I scaffold very well and that helps me with my AP students. Um, I, I don't just assume that they can do things. What I do is I just make a fool of myself, usually. Like I, I make a big dramatic production of whatever I'm reading or whatever I'm talking about or like how much I hate this character, how much I'm in love with this character. Like today in AP we were watching Jane Eyre and I, I kept saying, Michael Fassbender, my boyfriend, he's too pretty to be Mr. Rochester. Michael Fassbender, my boyfriend, you know, like I kept saying it and they were just like, by the end they were just like, oh, but they'll like, won't forget it, you know, so. And the other thing about it is that like, I am more myself in my classroom um, teaching my students than I am in some other social situations, you know? So it's a place where I'm very free, um, where I feel very confident. Um, and I, I just love it. I love every minute of it. I'm geared more toward the personal epiphany. Helping them see things that they haven't seen before. I think about that a lot. My two biggest goals are to help them be better citizens of the world, better empathizers, um, which they need to function, and to help them become lifelong readers. It's like, can you write well and express yourself well? That's gonna be so important. And can you read well? And then express yourself in writing about that reading. It's everything, it's our whole lives. Thank you.